and back in the video, one of my subscribers just wanted to call out to me and say, hey, how do you configure your Intel graphics correctly? Now, you have, depending on what your control panel looks like, there's two different types. There's an old version and a newer version, and a newer version will look more like this. It'll load up like this, look a lot more fancier. Now, the thing is that the first thing before we do anything is that we need to update the control panel first. The best way of doing that is going to the Intel website and downloading the Intel driver update utility. It's a free software provided by when provided by Intel and works for all operating systems. Windows Vista, Windows 7, Windows 8, Windows 8.1, and Windows 10. So, what we do is basically I have Windows 10, so I have to look it up through here. And then click yes. Start scan. This is after you install it though. After start searching for drivers. So I keep going. I do believe my drivers don't need to be updated, but after updating them, you are going to have to restart your computer in order to do them to um, to finalize the update. No matter what update it is, you're going to have to restart your computer. I'm just going to skip this because this is taking forever. But um, after that, we're going to go to 3D settings and then turn it to performance mode. Now, the th reason why we we're going to performance mode is so that we don't have to deal with any of them um, issues or you're going to have top of the line performance through this. Click yes, go back to home, go to power, and go to maximum performance in your battery or your power plan. Go back to home, go to display, and if you want to, you can also decrease the amount of resolution and refresh rate. But the refresh rate, you're going to need to keep it to 60p. Leave that alone, don't touch that. But you can freely go ahead and change the resolution. But it would more matter when you're, when you're in the game, is when you want to change the resolution, not really through here, because it wouldn't really make much of a difference, because the game would, would make more of a difference. But anyways, that's literally it on how you correctly set up your HD graphics to run on maximum performance. If you want me to do a video on Intel or AMD, that would be a, probably a different video because I don't have in I don't have Nvidia graphics or AMD Radeon graphics or anything like that, so I will not be able to do a video on that. I'll see you guys later. Catch you guys on the next one.